What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Diz TV. If this is your first time here, welcome home. We are so glad to have you. And Pixar Popcorn, 10 shorts have been released on Disney Plus. Today, I'm going to be ranking all 10 of those shorts from my least favorite to my favorite. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Kicking things off at number 10 is Soul of the City. This one is based off, of course, Disney Pixar's newest film, Soul, which released on Christmas Day of 2020 last year. The short of itself is pretty good. It's pretty much giving you different sights of around the city, some of the different characters that appeared in the movie Soul, and pretty much with just a piano background. Now, personally, there wasn't too much eventful things that happened in this short it's why it's ranked as of right now the lowest of them, but it still was a pretty good short. Kicking things off to number nine is Unparalleled Parking. This one is one of the Cars shorts, and this one is pretty good. Of course, it's taking a spin on the whole Paralleled Parking thing, which most people do learn as some of the Cars characters are attempting to learn how to parallel park. Some are successful, some not so much. This one is pretty good. It's a lot of fun. There is no dialogue in it, which does throw it off a little bit. Overall, pretty fun one. Coming in at number eight is To Fitness and Beyond. This one is one of the Toy Story ones and really is the one focusing on the main group of characters. Your Buzz, Rex, Ham, Mr. Potato Head. But this one is pretty fun. I do enjoy it. I think it is uh, kind of funny. Again, no dialogue, which really throws me off. It really does. But overall, it's a cute one. Coming in at number seven is Dancing with Cars. This one is the second of the Cars uh, shorts that we have here. Again, no dialogue in it, but it is pretty much showing how Cars dance to different music. But it's, it's a cute short. Nothing too extravagant there, and none of these really are extravagant. At number six is Chore Day. This one is the first of the Incredibles ones, and this one is fun. It shows how the Incredibles characters use their superpowers to take care of chores. I like this one a lot. It also has a cameo by the raccoon, so there's that for you. <laughs> at the halfway point at number five, we have A Day in the Life of the Dead. A little spin on the actual Day of the Dead thing. But this one is quite fun. You have two guys who accidentally lose control of a bicycle. And so you have that whole chaotic thing. You have a police officer whose jaw is like not really doing well. So he's like getting frustrated trying to, you know, talk and eat a donut and things of that sort. Uh, it really just is a fun little short. Coming in at number four is Dory Finding. Again, using the name, but flipping it around instead of Finding Dory. This one sees Dory taking a look at some stuff that is accidentally dropped into the ocean, such as glasses, a mirror, bottles, you know? Uh, it really is, it's, it's a cute short. Coming in at number three, we are almost to the end, is Cookie Num Num. Everyone's gone to sleep. Mr. Incredible wakes up notices that there is one cookie left, and now it's a fight between him, Dash, and Violet, and it really is a lot of fun, because they're trying to be quiet, because Elastigirl and Jack-Jack are sleeping on the couch, and so trying to prevent, you know, any noise so that they're, like, you know, don't have to worry about her getting mad at them. Uh, but it, it's, a, it's a fun short. It's one of the funnier ones uh, on this list. Coming in at number two is Ducky and Bunny love. This one is pretty much Ducky and Bunny, little banter uh, between the two uh, lovely characters. They're actually two of my favorites from uh, Pixar in general, but anyway, just the two of them bantering what kids would like better, Ducky or Bunny. It's a fun little banter. It's great. I love it. But coming in at number one is the other Ducky and Bunny short, Three Heads. Now, Ducky and Bunny, of course, are talking to Billy, Goat, and Gruff. Of course, these are Bo Peep's sheep. Uh, and it's just, it's a fun, trying to figure out why toy makers made a three-headed sheep uh, and kind of talking and being creeped out by it. It's a lot of fun. It's hilarious. I really did enjoy this short. And again, all of them are just really, really great. Anyway, that is it. That is my ranking of all 10 of the Pixar popcorn shorts. 
what a delightful thing to have uh, just as something to put on alongside you know your Disney classic cartoon shorts with Mickey, Donald, and Goofy. Let me know in the comments down below what is your favorite Pixar popcorn short. I hope we get more of them. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe down below and hit the bell to be notified for more videos on Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, the parks, and so much more. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a popcorn blast of a day. Goodbye.